Hi, I'm Almira Ilyana, class of 1999 in the School of Chemical Engineering. Hi, my name is Giovanna Crozel. I graduated 1999 in School of Engineering at Purdue University. So growing up, education was very important to our family and to our friends, and we were introduced to a lot of professionals who were educated. And so we were always encouraged to go, in, especially into the math and sciences. So that's where, how we ended up at Purdue. And we were born in the Philippines, and um, education was very important. We had a mantra, get good grades so you can get to a good school, so you can get a good job. And that was it. It was like the, the triple threat. So it was actually our one of our chemistry teachers in high school that had mentioned Purdue, and we hadn't even thought about it at all. So when we went to campus to visit it, it was like the perfect day, the sun was out, red brick, everything matched, everything was clean. We had a friend, we saw a friend of ours who had graduated high school and went to Purdue and was just magically there in the middle of the fountain and showed us around. So it just ended up being the perfect college trip. So in high school, only three people actually chose to go to Purdue in our class, and it was the valedictorian and us. And we tied actually with the same grade point average to the fourth decimal. I think we were like fourth. And so um, Purdue that, actually Purdue thought actually we were the same person. <laughs> thought we were the same person and uh, gave us a scholarship. And actually that's why we're so in, involved in scholarship and Purdue Association because we self-funded our college. We knew that we wouldn't be able to afford two people, two. let alone one person, to go to college. Um, I've been with Accenture, a global IT company, for 22 years now, ever since I graduated from Purdue. Uh, prior to that, I was a co-op um, in a pharmaceutical company and decided I don't want to wear a hard hat. So I wanted to try something different, and Purdue was you know, be having the education that I had um, enabled me to go into this kind of world of consulting that, that changes all the time. And um, now I'm also, um, I was president of the Purdue Club of Chicago. I'm now on the board of directors for the Purdue Alumni Association. I'm on the board, uh, the development committee board for the Adler Planetarium. And I'm involved with a lot of things in the city of Chicago, but everything that I love about the city. It's interesting because when I was younger, I knew I wanted something big. I wanted um, something important and something that actually made an impact to the world and going to Purdue actually helped that. I actually also did find the love of my life there so we became dual career in, uh, at GE and at that time I was the only female engineer in the process plants and that actually helped me grow into what I am today, which is, I'm not even in engineering anymore, I'm actually in finance, uh, in procurement. I think surround yourself with really good friends because, um, you know, it's true, birds of a feather flock together. And um, when we were growing up, our I'm, we're still friends with our friends back in middle school and high school, and even now through college, 22 years later. When I travel for work, I travel internationally from Russia to Brazil to Japan to China. And if you're wearing a Purdue, which I usually do, uh, wear something Purdue and I bring my Purdue Hello Kitty with me, it sparks a conversation and at least a boiler up. Having that kind of connection, it's, it's literally changed our lives. We've met so many amazing people from all different walks of life and it's given us enrichment outside of work, play, comfort, um, volunteerism, friends, and uh, even this today uh, would not be possible without Purdue. Oh, go to Purdue. It's the best university ever. Really, it is. Um, we looked at a lot of other universities. We were offered a lot of scholarships, but at the end of the day, when you rack them all up, Purdue really ended up being the best choice.